getting close to Christmas. I think everybody's doing their Christmas shopping. And I always buy stocking stuffers. And so I thought today we talk about some stocking stuffers that are prepper related, but therefore non-preppers and preppers alike. Because if you're like me, most of your relatives and friends are probably non-preppers. But we still buy them gifts anyway, don't we? I think we all love knives and flashlights. And here's a combination together by Life Gear. I got this on the clearance counter of Tuesday morning and I think I paid under $5 for it. So here's that Life Gear tool up close. It has a bottle opener, a knife as you can see, and a flashlight. And the nice thing about it is it can recharge by USB. Really a nice gift for a student, I think. Of course, the student should not take it to school or they will get in trouble. <laughs> so I got a bunch of these sound grenades. They were the lightning deal on Amazon. They were under $6. And I thought they'd make great stocking stuffer for a lot of my friends. So as you can see, this sound grenade has a 120 decibel alarm. Let's check it out. So it's got a nice little carabiner. Let's see what happens when we pull it. Yeah, it is loud. Trust me on that, loud. And the nice thing about this, it is permitted on airplanes. So it is a safety tool that you can carry with you when you're traveling. And you know, not every place allows concealed carry. In fact, a lot of places don't. When you go to the hospital, no. But you know what? Hospital parking lots can be pretty dangerous. So this is not a bad idea to keep something like this on your keychain, just in case. If you live in an area of the country that gets ice or snow, get your loved ones some yak tracks. These are the pro model, so they were a little more expensive. I believe they were around $25. You can get them cheaper in the stores but they are great to have. So this is the Yak Track Pro and it has coil seat and it can go on your shoes or on your boots, which is great because often I run out of the house and I don't put on my boots, but I can slip this over my shoes really easy. Now I'm gonna keep this in my car so I have it when I need it. I actually had an experience where, well, this maybe was five years ago, I was just running out to my car in the parking lot from work and slipped flat on my back and my head. I had my cell phone in my hand. It went flying and eventually I was able to get up and I climbed into my car and I sat in the seat and it was like all these lights were going through a tunnel and I was scared. It's like, oh my God, I'm driving my car. I can't see, you know, obviously I had a bit of a concussion. Anyway, turned out to be fine, but from then on, I wear something like this to make sure I don't slip and get a head injury. So a great gift for a loved one. Everybody can use flashlights. These were five of the Cree flashlights. Uh, another lightning deal on Amazon. I think I spent $12 for all five, and I believe they're around $15 now for all five on Amazon. I'll leave a link. So it's a five pack of flashlights, different colors, black, silver, blue, green, and red. And they're actually adjustable. Um, it's up to 300 lumen. And the nice thing about them, they just use one AA battery or you can use a rechargeable battery. So a great little stocking stuffer. And again, I think most of us love multi-tools. I was in Tuesday morning and I picked up this 22 function tool and it's by protocol. And I got it for $11.99 and it's normally $19.99. So this has pliers, needle nose pliers, wire cutter, large knife, 11 screwdriver bits. And that's especially why I got it. I got this for my older son. Bottle opener, small blade, fish scaler, file, hook remover, ruler, and can opener. So that's nice, it has a can opener, not just a bottle opener. But pretty compact, and definitely I like that it has the bits. And again, who doesn't love fishing? 
I picked up this Fisherman Plus at Tuesday morning for $19.99. However, it doesn't really fit in a stocking. So if you want to fit in a stocking, look at this size. This is what my piddly stick fits into, and I don't have it in here because I have it in my bags. But I have a video on it. I'll put a link to it here. Um, here, you know, wherever that little eye comes up. And if you want to see it, but I really had a lot of fun using my piddly stick. And you can get these online for only $29. So this All-in-One Fisherman Plus uh, is a compact folding fishing set by Protocol. Let's see it here a bit. And this gives you a better idea right here. You can see it doesn't take up too much space. It has a storage department that you can keep hooks and things in. Uh, the reel's right here. It comes with a float, hook, swivel, sinker, and of course you have your rod. And it even has a protective pouch. So just a nice little thing to maybe throw in your car just in case the urge goes to go fishing and you don't have your equipment. So this is the site uh, for the piddly stick. And as you can see, it comes with some fishing accessories, but it's in such a small little tube. It is great for a bug out bag or even to stick in your purse, ladies. Um, I had a lot of fun fishing with this. And again, something for males as well as females, it's always nice to have a nice sewing kit. And I mean, do you see this? It's really well equipped. And right now this is going for $16 on Amazon. There was a lightning deal and I think I got it for under $12. Here's inside that sewing kit. Look at all the different color threads you have. And if you have to do a small repair, you hate to run out and buy the perfect match spool of thread because thread is now expensive and you may never use that color again. So this is really, really nice. Now on the other side, you have a little magnifying glass over here. You can see you have all your different needles. You have some snaps here, pin cushion. Uh, these are helping you, if you're visually impaired like me, to thread your needles, which is nice. Um, here's if you have to pull out your work. Um, there's a big needle like for putting through um, if you get snarls in your sweater. Little tweezers, little marking pencil. Uh, dressmaker, measuring tape, it, I mean you can just see pins, thimbles, I mean really it has a load of different items and like I said I think I got it for $12 it was so reasonable but you know it's definitely worth $16 also just a wonderful kit to give a son or daughter leaving the house so they'll have to do their own repairs now um, this is a great little kit and actually I got this kit for myself because I just thought it's so neat how everything fits in one place compared to my clunky sewing case. And sometimes necessities are a great idea to put into a Christmas stocking. This is an automatic digital blood pressure cuff. I got it at Tuesday morning for $14.99, normally $29.99. And I'm getting this for my son, because my older son seems to be developing a blood pressure problem, even though he is skinny as a rail. So you can see it has a really easy to read digital display. And here on the side, it shows you, it has memory recall also, and explains on how to read your results. And with the new <laughs> blood pressure ruling, uh, a lot more people are going to have high blood pressure than ever before. So, great gift for a loved one. Along that same lines, I got this forehead thermometer. It's really small, just this big, so a prepper might like to place this in their med kit in their vehicle. Great idea to have on hand. I got it for $11.99 at Tuesday mornings, and it's normally $19.99. So I took the forehead thermometer out of the packaging. Can you see it's on my finger? I just put this area on a forehead, and I can get an instant read. Now, I am keeping this for myself. I'm gonna put it in my car medical kit, but it's a great gift also. If you have a family member who always seems to be misplacing their keys, you might wanna consider this for a stocking stuffer. 
It is the Sharper Image Portable Electronic Key Finder. I got it for my younger son because he seems to have that problem. And this was $9.99. So this portable electronic key finder has a 45 foot range, which should be fine for my son. You can see it's just a little thing that fits on the key fob. And hopefully this will work for him because he often loses his keys. And this way he should be able to find it without being late for work. A nice little stocking stuffer. And something else uh, which is nice for a stocking stuffer is any of these renewable lighting sources from UV pack light. Uh, I keep this generally on my bug out bag on the outside. You can easily see it and it glows nicely in the dark. And they have ones that are little circles that will fit on your keychain or even flashlights. So again, a nice stocking stuffer you can find for UV pack light. And I'll put the link below. So those were some of my ideas. I hope your Christmas stockings are filled to the brim with things that you can use and enjoy. This is Prepper Popery saying, please subscribe and share the knowledge. Happy holidays.